Business Spotlight is brought to you by Indiana Small Business Development Center. Today on Good Day Live, we are really happy to have in studio with us Courtney Ritchie from the Small Business Development Center. Welcome to the studio. Thank you. We want to thank you for the relationship we've been able to build with you to be able to bring the stories of small businesses right. in our communities all across the Wabash Valley who are using and utilizing what you guys offer. So first of all, thank you. You're welcome. Thank we, you for coming. We have it. had a I ball. I mean, it's been great. It's yeah. been so much fun. Yeah. yeah. And, and now what you guys are doing is opening the door to people out there who may be looking for even more help. First of all, what is it that you have coming up for businesses? So we are hosting a Small Business Advocates Luncheon on October 16th. So we all look at our office as being advocates for small business. We want to see our small businesses stay here and grow. So what we're doing is bringing in some state resources to show our local business owners that, hey, if you have an opportunity to export, to expand your business or do business with the government or maybe grow employees and want to see what incentives are out there to be able to do that in the state of Indiana they're there so we're bringing everybody together to have that conversation so our small business owners don't feel alone it's hard starting a business on your own right may not have a big employee base may not have a lot of people kind of behind you but the state is there and we do have a lot of resources so we're trying to highlight that and let people know that they um, that they have those resources available why is it important that small businesses take this opportunity to go to this luncheon mm -hmm. yeah Okay, so when you're working in a small business, you're putting out fires every day. You know, somebody calls in, so you're the one running um, that operation, or now you're the IT person. It's really hard to work on your business. Yeah. You work in your business. So it's time, you know, everybody's busy, but to give your an hour and a half to learn about these resources, because maybe you're doing things that are taking a lot of time out of your day, these small business owners, there might be a resource available that could help you with that. And that's what we're trying to highlight, that they take that time, come out, see what's available to them. And we're going to have service providers there too. Okay. So like local bankers, lo local CPA firms, local marketing agencies. And basically just to show if there are people in this town that you may be able to outsource some of these time stressful activities that you've been doing on your own because you really didn't know there was another way. Mm -hmm. We're bringing in service providers that um, are able to help in that way. So we're hoping they'll see maybe there is light at the end of the tunnel. There's things that can help them um, grow without adding a lot of time to their already hectic schedule. Well, and I think too, you're opening the door to people who may be on the cusp of really even starting mm, a business sure, or yeah. starting to expand their business and yeah. go to areas mm -hmm. they hadn't thought about before. Sure. Coming into a place like this, into mm -hmm. this type of an event, mm -hmm. you're networking, mm -hmm. you're meeting people, right. you're learning, and, and I just don't know that people understand the value of something like that in our sure. community. Sure. Yeah, you know, when you're in kind of the corporate world, networking is kind of, you just have to do it, right? Right. And again, when you're in a, a small business situation, you may see that it's important, but when you've got to you finish a job, um, sometimes it's hard to put that as a priority. So we're hoping that people will see, based on our lineup of speakers, we have somebody from the Department of Revenue that's going to talk about the new tax laws. Mm -hmm. We have somebody that from our exporting division that's going to talk about those resources if somebody ever gets the opportunity to export. Because even if you have a service, nowadays, the minute you put a website up, you're opening yourself to an international market. Mm -hmm. So what if you get that call? So even if you're not planning on exporting, you may need to know what those steps are. So we're going to have that there for them so that they can come out and, and be able to get that information. Yeah. When I think about laws and regulations and all the things that go uh -huh. into it, my gosh, it can it's be. It is. Yeah. So this now. is a really good chance for mm -hmm. all of you out there who are interested to be part of this Small Business Advocates Luncheon. It's coming up October 16th, so it really is fast approaching. My question to you would be, do they have to go to the eventbrite.com to get tickets or may they buy them that day if last minute they're like, we can show up or do they need to sure. buy them in advance? We'd appreciate in advance just because we are providing lunch, so it sure. helps us. But you know what? We know what it's like, again, with your hectic schedule. If you don't know if you can attend and then that day you can, come. All are welcome. All righty. Well, it's going to be a great program, so mark your calendar October 16th. Help your business grow. Make a difference. I, I don't know why anyone wouldn't take advantage of this. And to be honest, they got to take advantage of the services you offer. Seriously. Thank you for what you do. Thank you. Really appreciate it. Stay with us. More to come on Good Day Live.